All right, guys, we are back and we are going to talk about the brand new Doctor Strange poster we got that came along with, of course, that trailer. If you guys haven't seen my reaction or breakdown, I'll leave that up there. Now let's get to the intro and then to the poster. Okay, so here is the poster. This is our official poster. This is the one that you're going to see in most theaters. You know, they're going to be putting this one up all over the walls and everything. This is the one they want you to be aware of. Pretty much, you know, the one that they want, like, synonymous with the film. I thought the last poster with the, you know, many faces and everything was very good. But again, that didn't have as much pop, right? This is your Hollywood poster. Now, what I appreciate about this one is the fact that they were very, um, how do I put this? Not Marvel studios -y. You know, they didn't have the poster with the dude in the middle with their arms out or whatever, the giant head looking over everything, uh, the character in the middle just looking stoic, and then every single other character around it. Mind you, they're going to make one. We know they are, but this isn't it, right? Um, This is way more artistic, I would say, way more asking many questions. And again, if you start looking into the poster, like start looking through the details and digging into it, you're going to notice little fragments here or there. There's definitely a hint towards Captain Carter, like you see her shield, like she's going to appear in live action. That's kind of been confirmed ever since whenever the film, you know, started really leaking things. But again, this is a good poster for what it is and what it is is a good poster to get you aware of this film. Now, I think, honestly, as we continue to get closer to the film, you're going to start seeing some terrible ones. Again, this always happens because, you know, there's just various amounts of designers and things that go into it and posters that don't appeal to everybody. Like, for example, a poster like this will not appear, like, anywhere in territories that don't like posters like this, right? Like, they like posters that are more character front and center or just a face or your typical you know just a character standing there with like a solid background which is why you sometimes get some of those terrible posters but overall i feel this one is great um i've seen a little bit of backlash to it but as with anything you expect to get that overall i like this i think it's a good poster what's your guys' take on this um you know literally what do you guys feel about this is this something that you think is worthy of that mcu you know look at it it lines up well and do you guys think that this is going to be the one they use for the blu-ray slash dvd release because that's what i want to know well like what's this going to look like in my collection you know that's that's the big one when i pull out the steel book is it this or is it going to be something else i just hope to god it's not that giant mess you know like somebody barfed up all the characters but it's marvel studios so it could be 